Hello guys, my name is Doak, and today I will pimp or improve or destroy your artworks. Just as I said in the beginning of this year, I want to be more community focused. And because of this, I created a subreddit. A subreddit of this channel. I don't know if you know Reddit, but lots of YouTubers are recently using this website to create community. More about my Reddit at the end of the video, because right now I want to jump straight to your artworks. I got all of them from my Reddit and I'm about to pimp them. Okay, we got artwork number one over here. It's a graffiti sketch which says Dems. The first thing that immediately caught my attention is this ugly tag on the bottom part of the S. But overall, I like the vibe of this sketch and I think that I won't have that much work with it. Oh, how terribly wrong I was. First of all, I decided to point out the mistakes that I don't like, point out the things that doesn't really work in this sketch for me, and I started to get rid of them. Most of these mistakes were shape-based mistakes. The lines didn't have correct position for my eye. I also didn't really like these cracks in the letters. But as you can see on the letter M, I was quite struggling with the right proportions of, of the letters. It took me one hour to finish the, the recreation of this sketch and during the, during the process I didn't feel good about doing this. One of the reasons was that I was doing the remake in a, in a Photoshop and, and the original lines didn't really fit good together with the new lines made in computer. Over here you can see the difference. Um, I can't really say that I improved this sketch, I just tried to repair some stuff that I didn't like and it turned out like this. This is the artwork number two, as you can see we want to do just graffiti sketches over here. It is a painting of a bird on a canvas. Overall I, I, I like this artwork but there are some things that I would love to change. At this point I realized that I didn't choose the, the best way how to improve your sketches. That's why later in this video I will change my approach. If we want to talk about the bird painting, I really liked it, except, except the background. I didn't really like the colors, the composition and stuff. So I decided to change it, I decided to put different colors over there. Also a little bit improved the eye. And yeah, it turned out, well different, but I can't really say that it looks better. Maybe yes, maybe no. But I'm pretty sure that it looks much much better without that tag. This is the artwork number three. It is a graffiti painting on a wall. The first thing that took my attention is this ugly background, or if I can even call it a background. Also, these tags around. I, I, I really don't like when people are making tags right next to their artworks. Sometimes it looks good, but most of the times it, it doesn't. I tried to improve this painting in a little bit different way. Actually, I decided to completely repaint it and take the idea from the original painting. I enjoyed this repair much more than the previous ones because I felt like I'm building my own sketch or my own painting. I use the same colors, the same elements, and this is how it turned out. The artwork number four, this is a digital artwork, probably made in Photoshop. It says bots. The first thing that took my attention is this is this background. I I can't really say that I that I like him. But if you want to talk about the letters, they look Quite solid. Let's make few adjustments. I really didn't want to change the letters of this sketch because I was quite satisfied with them. 
I only started to work on the background. I've put a new shadow over there, some background effects. In the original drawing, the background had the same color as the letters, which sometimes works, but when I see green letters, I have to put purple background over there. So far I improved four of your sketches, but right now I would love to try something else. You know, I've prepared multiple concepts for the collaboration between my Reddit and my YouTube channel. This is one of them, but I'm not really sure if I, if I like this one. I have to say that I like the, the redrawing your sketches on a paper much more. So right now I would love to try something else. I would love to go through the artworks that you posted into my Reddit, into Dog Squad, and I would love to give you my commentary about them. People ask me to do this all the time, tell me what you think about my sketch, so I will try to do that right now. And you can let me know in the comments below which of these two concepts you like more. We'll see how we will do this. So I started our Reddit page based on hot posts. And the first one that we see is this eagle that I already improved. And this is another artwork. It says Dexter. After lots of sketching, I finally come up with this. Uh, I can't really decide if it is a trophy or, or, or something else. But if it is your first painting, good job. I'm Boaster, 15 years old from Germany. 15 years old. Man, these Germans are just... <sighs> Okay, hope you enjoyed this masterpiece. There are two things that immediately caught my attention. First of all, this Jack Daniels bottle is just insanely good. Everything, it's, it's perfect. But if you want to talk about the rest of this artwork, especially about these doodles, I tried the doodles before. I was also inspired by Wax. And I have to say that it is hard to do something else, especially when you don't know other doodle guys, but this is just too much Wax. But I highly appreciate that you called it a masterpiece. Don't call your pieces masterpieces. It's in a sketchbook, whoa. I never understood why people do this in sketchbooks. I can imagine that the painting of this part is super hard, but yeah, we have a super nice dragon over here, although I would love to see a little bit more sharp details of his head. And if you want to talk about this graffiti, um, I just realized that this painting is probably was probably inspired by our Godzilla wall with snow. Yeah, he, he used a dragon instead of a Godzilla. And these colors are definitely the colors that we use in our piece. And I also got a feeling that I know this head over here. Yeah, do you remember my video where I painted on an, air, on an airplane? I think that he used the same picture as a reference photo, but that's not a problem at all, you know? It's kind of hard to imagine your own dragon. <laughs> Cash tree. I really appreciate the idea, I really appreciate that it's on a tree and that the letters are like leaves. Really creative, but when I take a closer look at the letters, they are not that awesome. We got another graffiti sketch over here, Mace. Although I see some little mistakes just as this part over here is a little bit crooked. Also this part. I appreciate the tag. You know, I don't like tags next to graffiti pieces, but this one doesn't bother me that much. And I don't really understand why this part is yellow, and I don't really understand the shape of this part, but overall, good style. Okay, this is something completely different from the other artworks. By the way, I highly appreciate that you post not just graffiti. I really like that. Whoa. I don't like this, this person over here that much, but when I look at these windows and stuff, great job. Okay. Body painting, it says bear. Probably I will blur out this thing a little bit. You never know what YouTube will do. <laughs> we got another graffiti sketch over here which says Dexter. And the first comment below this post is Rasco. And yeah, it's the first thing that came to my mind. That it's, it's a Rasco style. Or at least Rasco styled effects. This happens when you are too much inspired by, by somebody but it happens to all of us, sometimes a little bit less, sometimes a little bit too much. I would say that this is a little bit too much, but I've been doing graffiti for four months now. Okay, Tupac. Yeah, man, 
to park. For somebody who does graffiti for four months, it's quite okay. The shapes are not awesome for sure. I don't really get this, this black thing. These guys look like palm trees and this looked like Tupac character that didn't come up well. So you just covered him in black. Is that true? Yes? No? Graffiti sketch goal. I really have to look for the letters, but this is G I H O L No O L I don't I don't really understand this part. What's this? It's kind of hard to read it. Plurs. Okay. Nice colors. A little bit weird shapes, especially this R. A little wild from Slovakia. Yeah, I really like this style. I really do. Once again, I'm having a problem to read it, but I already see it. I like the color combination. I don't really like these these details over here. They just look like they don't, they just shouldn't be there, but you are from Slovakia. I have to put your thumb up and give you a vote. Okay, this is a nice stencil doors. Okay, I, I think that I've seen this D somewhere. But don't you worry, you're gonna get rid of it. Okay, we got some graffiti painting on a wall over here. Nice colors, but the rest, I can't really see what's there. Hello there, since you said art of any kind, I thought it might be interesting to post still. This is the sort of stuff that I'm just trying to learn. And I don't really feel like a person who should give you advice about these things, but I would use more contrast, a little bit more dark pencil. Yeah, my little mermaid. I wouldn't like to meet this mermaid in a sea. This is a nice job. Iconi, Dog Squad, Germany. Is that N or W? This part over here. I like the first three letters. The last two are sort of off, but yeah. Please don't do these tags like this. I, I, I don't like that. Whoa, okay. This is a painting in somebody's room and uh, hi dog, I made this piece when I was 11, 11 years old. For 11 years old guy, it's completely okay, but I wouldn't paint it in a room. We got another painting on a wall and it seems that this guy knows what he is doing, but there are two things that I don't like. First one, why did you cut the lower parts of the letters like this? It doesn't really feel good to me. And these parts, these upper parts, they should be more you know what I mean by that more. <laughs> Once again, tags around peace. I don't know, I don't like it, but maybe you like it, I, it doesn't matter. IRA from Germany. I used to do the same. I used to do super complicated sketches when I was younger, but the truth is that most of the time people should start with something less complicated. <laughs> oh boy. Ill... Illegal? Yeah, illegal. Super cool. No, I... <laughs> okay. Helix. Man, I don't know how did you come up with these shapes, but it's... One mistake that I see is that you don't have a background color. It just makes everything looks like a mess. But this character over here <laughs> looks funny. Thanks for all your submissions and please let me know in the comments below which of these two ways of using Reddit do you prefer? And I would love to see more stuff from you on my Reddit. For example, memes or maybe videos, something funny. I have to say that I quite enjoy this commentary stuff. So definitely subscribe to my subreddit Dog Squad. There will be a link in the description below. And I, I want to say you one more thing. If you have seen the video this one where I shared my story. I told you there that it was super important for me to have a community where I can share my stuff, where other people can comment my stuff and so on. So I would love to create something like that on my Reddit. It should be a community, a place where you can share your stuff. Other people might maybe help you. Maybe sometimes I can help you. The best stuff from this Reddit will get to my videos so you can have some extra motivation. <laughs> And yeah, I hope that this community will, will be great. Okay guys, thanks for watching and see you next time.